The sun shines not on us, but in us. The rivers flow not past us, but through us. Thrilling, tingling, vibrating every fibre and cell of the substance of our bodies, making them glide and sing. The trees wave and the flowers bloom in our bodies as well as our souls. And every bird song, wind song, and tremendous storm song of the rocks in the heart of the mountains is our song, our very own, and sings of our love. Before we go any further, I implore you to take a moment to pause, to let all of this sink in. Today is a celebration, a chance for you to reflect back on the years you've spent together so far, an opportunity to share in all of the fun and excitement of this once in a lifetime day, and of course, a celebration of all that is awaiting you both as husband and wife. Oh my <laughs> God, look at you. You look like you look like poetry. <laughs> you look so gorgeous. Oh, so you're gonna make me cry. Oh, oh, we need to kiss each other. Whatever. Yours is a modern day love story, an online meeting in the midst of a global pandemic. You texted each other for about a week before deciding to meet in person. That first date being a three mile hike at Oak Openings Metro Park. The very same spot that John proposed at the luxury picnic in May of 2022. Sophie, for as long as I can remember, I've lived with one foot always in other worlds, daydreaming and exploring and reading about stories where anything is possible. But ours is a story I did not expect. A story so fantastical, I never could have possibly dreamt it up in my wildest dreams. It has been, and continues to be, everything I could have asked for and more. I feel as though I am part of you, and you are part of me but we have not lost ourselves in each other. My life is indescribably better with you in it. So much more beautiful than anything I could have ever imagined. I'm so excited to see what forever has in store. As long as we always choose each other and put our love first, we will continue to build something beautiful and everlasting. And on your eight mile hike in Pinckney, Michigan, about a month into dating, something was solidified for the both of you. As you goofed around on the trail and Sophia jokingly tried to tackle you to the ground, <laughs> in that moment she looked into your eyes, she saw your smile, and you knew that you were the one. But Sophia and John, look where your love has taken you today. To one of the most beautiful places in the world, hand in hand with this person you love more than anything else in the world, ready and excited to see where the rest of your lives is going to take you. I stand before you today as someone who loves you more than anything in this world. And it is my honor to dedicate the rest of my life to writing with you the greatest story I will ever have a part in, the story of you and I. I know how special, rare, and true our love is. And I also know this kind of love takes work and dedication. So the greatest vow I can make to you is to always stand by your side and choose you through the highs and the lows. John and Sophia, without further ado, it is with great excitement <laughs> that I may now pronounce you husband and wife. Woo It is the ultimate.
ultimate commitment that you get to make to one another. I promise that you will choose each other today and always, no matter what, and under any circumstances. You are forever my greatest adventure. I love you always, forever yours. <laughs> I will never stop dreaming of all the fantastical things I know that you and I will accomplish together and that I will take on whatever challenges you and I face with courage worthy of even the greatest of heroes. Safe in the knowledge that no matter what, as long as we have each other, we will always reach our happy ending. As none other than Bilbo Baggins said to Frodo, it's a dangerous business going out your door. You step onto the road and if you don't keep your feet, there is no knowing where you might get swept off to. Love is very much the same. It's dangerous falling in love with someone as you never know where it might take you. After everything that you have experienced so far, for as serious as all of that might sound, you know that you've got everything it takes.